Hell yeah, what's up guys? This is Curse Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today, we're talking about bricking. That's right, guys. There's a brick problem. In particular, the EVGA 3090 graphic cards are bricking in some cases while playing New World. Now, I'm going to go into the details of what could be the issue here, but I am very interested in what side you think. Is this an EVGA problem? Are they liable or culpable? Or is this an Amazon New World problem? I actually don't know. Let me tell you what we know so far. On the EVGA side of things, there is a allegation. I haven't confirmed it personally, but apparently in some of their 3090s, they used non-approved capacitors. So NVIDIA obviously didn't approve them or they went around and they took a shortcut. And yeah, well, the cards are bricking. On the New World Amazon front, apparently they did not cap the frame rates in the menus. This is where most of the incidences are occurring is when you're in the menus, uh, there's no cap. So for these high-end cards, they're just getting up to like crazy temperatures. And in some cases, they've completely melted down, um, as, uh, as you can see here. So again, hard to say. I, I don't have proof um, of the EVGA stuff, but what we do know is that New World or Amazon has weighed in and that Luxendra, who's a community manager, said two things. One, they only make standard direct X calls as provided by the Windows API, so they're playing by the book. And also, they've released a patch, a hotfix, I suppose, that basically caps frames per second on the menu screen, so just to be extra careful. Um, EVGA has not responded as the time of this video, so we're not sure where they what they're going to say, but uh, that's basically the issue. What do you think? EVGA is the problem? Is it Amazon New World? Is Bezos up in space and he should be down here taking care of graphic cards? Um, one of the fixes you can do, though, is you can download MSI Afterburner and you can manage your temperatures better. So, yeah, uh, I mean, this patch should do the trick, but you can use MSI Afterburner on any card, including MSI, of course, but um, yeah, and if you have a 3090, what's your experience been like? I've got a 2070, and I can tell you right now, it runs real damn hot, but I haven't had any meltdowns or issues, but if you've had an issue, let us know in the comments below. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned. Be back soon.